Akron Children's Hospital is moving its entire neonatal intensive care unit or NICU from St. Elizabeth's in Youngstown to the Boardman campus. WKBN reporter Nadine Grimley sat down with health professionals to talk about the new space and how they'll care for their patients during that move. The move is less than a month away, but officials with Akron Children's Hospital have been planning for years. Right now, the NICU staff is learning the layout of their new space. There's a multitude of changes for our nursing staff. Um, they're moving from being in one room and a small room with up to 25 babies in it to this very large, spacious facility. The new facility has 23 individual rooms, two of which are built for multiples. It's a much more private and more family-centered concept. Michael says the private rooms also reduce infection rates and create a better environment for parents to bond with their children. It's going to be better for the patient. They're going to be in a much quieter environment. Their privacy will be maintained because they'll be in their own room. Um, the families will be able to spend as much time as they want in the room. Come the day of the big move, two transport teams from Akron Children's Hospital will be moving the babies from Youngstown to Boardman. Officials expected to take two to two and a half hours to move each patient. This project will take a huge number of staff. It will take four physicians, four nurse practitioners who specialize in NICU care, multiple respiratory therapists, medics, nurses, and others. There are a lot of people involved in this move. The big move is set for April 7th in Boardman. I'm Nadine Grimley, WKBN 27 First News.